Mike Johnson, uh, you've got the specialists of marketing specialists from the world's dairy industry with you in Belfast this week. What is it that you're, you're hoping to achieve during the week? number of things. Uh, first of all, we want to try and improve on the level of cooperation that there is between generic and brand around the world. Secondly, we want to exchange best practice on how dairy is marketed, both from a branded point of view and a generic point of view. And thirdly, uh, we want to look at the future of dairy marketing uh, and what might be the sorts of things that generic and brand should be thinking about doing in the future. Now you've got specialists in generic, you've got specialists uh, in branded marketing, you've got people from the companies, you've got people from the dairy councils around the world. Are countries around the world still prepared to put forward funds for generic marketing? The evidence from those that are here this week is a very definite yes. Uh, there is a realisation in countries around the world that the best option from a dairy marketing point of view a strong cooperation between brand and generic, with the role of generic being to create that positive environment in which the brands can drive revenue. Now, social media is featuring very largely in communication nowadays. Is the dairy industry exploiting this to its best advantage? Is whether, it a threat or an opportunity? Whether it's currently exploiting it to its best advantage is something that we are going to be looking at this week. And one of the things that I'm hoping will come out of this is uh, an agreement that we will work together as an industry on a global basis much better. Mike Johnson, thank you very much indeed.